information thing that means there might be a map. There's a resort area map, take it. Okay, so yep. So we're in the resort area. And, uh, where did we just come out of? We are next to Old Silent Hill. We are right next to South Park, of course. That's to be called South Park, but Craig Street, Annie's Bar, Indian Runner, blah blah blah. We're on Backman Street, next to Sanford Street and West Sanford Street. There's a lighthouse and the lakeside. All right, so let's see. What we're, let's go the way I'm headed right now. Just to confirm there's a dead end here. Dead ends in Silent Hill. Who would have thought? Nail, 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 nail. Sue, nail, 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 nail. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Oh, fucking pterodactyl! I don't want a pterodactyl die! The doors are locked. Of course, barely avoid a military dactyl attack. What the? Puppies, too. Why does everything hate me in this town? <laughs> Dead end over there. Probably Annie's bar there. Yeah. It kind of has bigger bond than everything else, so you think it's not important. Yeah. Well, alas, I'm still running. Yeah. What the? That's not a dog. Yeah. It's one of those really creepy things. Where am I even going right now? Because I'm going down Wave Street. Next to the end. I wonder if I didn't recognize that sound. I thought it was Harry at first or something. That thing's still chasing me. He's doing the ooh noise sound effects. He can chase by everything. <laughs> Alright, so besides the fact they're being chased by everything and their mother, where are we at right now? I still bet it's Annie's bar. That was supposed to be a. Oh no, not one of those things! Get off the. <laughs> Alright, so according to my map, it's probably Annie's bar that we're trying to go to. I'm kind of tempted to check out this fountain over here, and I'm sure this is the right way. I shouldn't, because I'm being chased by a million things right now, but you know, I'm curious to take a cat and all that. Still, yeah, I can still hear and see the hoo guy. He's closer behind me than anything else right now. He's like skipping on my trail. <laughs> Alright, and these bars. There's another one of those things. Oh, there was a door I began to turn to. Well, barely got away from that situation. Now what's going on? Are you okay? Yeah, I guess so. But I'm beat. I thought I was a goner there. So how'd it go? Did you find a way out? No, not yet. How about you? Zip. But it's too soon to give up. This craziness can't go on forever. 
A military rescue squad should be here any time now. If they come through the town, we're home free. I hope so. I better get going. This isn't the time to stand around flapping our gums. Do you know a girl called Alessa? No.
What's this? Sybil. Harry. How did you get back here? I followed the sewer. Were you the one who cut the fence? I'm glad you made it. I was worried about you. You were worried? Where did you disappear to? Never mind. I want to know what's going on here. What is with this town? This may sound really off the wall, but listen to me. You've got to believe me. I haven't gone crazy, and I'm not fooling around. At first, I thought I was losing my mind. But now I know I'm not. It's not me. This whole town. It's being invaded by the other world world of someone's nightmarish delusions come to life. Little by little, the invasion is spreading, trying to swallow up everything in darkness. I think I'm finally beginning to understand what that lady was talking about. Harry, hold on a minute. I don't get it. Look, I don't understand it all myself. I guess I can't explain it. What's making this happen? I don't know that either. 
But I do know Cheryl is there. There? Under whoever created this darkness. Cheryl is somewhere and she needs my help. This whole thing's been a major blow to you. You need to rest. Sybil, I... The demon is awakening, spreading those wings! Dahlia Gillespie. Was it not as I said? I see it all now. Yes, everything. Hungry for sacrifice, the demon will swallow up the land. I knew this day would come. And what's more, the task is almost finished. There's only two left. To seal this town to the abyss, the mark of Samael. When it is completed, all is lost. Even in daytime, darkness will cover the sun. The dead will walk and martyrs will burn in the fires of hell. Everyone will die. So what am I supposed to do? I've got to save Cheryl. <laughs> she does it all is this Stop shit. The demon. And like how the world is coming to an end. All he thinks about, I've got to save Cheryl. That child's form. Stop it before your daughter becomes a sacrifice. Before it is too late. Stop it! Stop it! What do I do? Go to the lighthouse on the lake. And to the center of the amusement park. Make haste. You are the only hope. Look, Harry. I really don't get what's going on. But if there's a chance we can save your daughter, I'm in. I'll check out the amusement park. You go to the lighthouse. Sybil, thanks. You will need to use it. Use what? The flowers. Only with that can you stop it. What about Sybil? Well, thing is, I already know Dolly is a bitch, but to be honest, I don't know the specifics of why she's a bitch. I mean, I know she's the true mother of Alessa, which is the step bomb, but there's a lot I still don't know. There's some manga bullets, take it. Yep. What's over here, though? There's some rifle shells, take it. Yep, I haven't found a rifle yet. There's a health drink, take it. Sure thing. Boss. There's a ship's wheel. Don't worry about that now, though. To be honest, there's a few things that are missing, I feel. Because I know Silent Hill has more than one ending. And with that, I know when you're dubbing cutscenes, there's a few things that are missing here, which I'm kind of worried about. Because I want to get the best possible ending I can possibly get, of course. But, let's see. Looking around right now. Well, what's all in my inventory? Because I know there was a cutscene that we dubbed when we were dubbing this after the cutscene with Kaufman where you see him in the bar. I'm not sure if it came after the cutscene I just saw or not, but there was a cutscene where you meet with Kaufman and he grabs something that kind of looks like a bottle of ketchup from a motorcycle thing. I know that's very, very important to the whole plot of the game. So I'm trying to think to myself where that happens because as of right now I don't know and I feel like maybe that's the item in the game that makes a huge difference to the plot of this game. So I'm feeling if I don't pick up that item that I'm not going to end up with one of the good endings. So I'm trying to think right now though because I don't know, I'm pretty sure it has to do with that receipt that I found on Kaufman's like thing and the Kaufman's key even. Because so far it seems like I'm skipping out on some mission where I should be doing it. 
Of course, I probably have a chance to do it later, but I'm wondering what it is, because I don't see a general store anywhere here, so there must be another part of town. I'll see if I soon after this lighthouse business can get there, because there's not an amusement park here. Wait, no, there's an amusement park going to this to, on the next part of town. So there's something to look into. I might take this chance for a second to just look into that for a second. Not because I want to spoil myself too much, just because I want to see if it's supposed to be something I'm able to do now. So I will be right back. Alright, so luckily the Silent Hill wiki was the first thing that popped up. I decided that the search term I should search up would be Kaufman's Key. And I'm hoping it's not too late to do this. As far as I just went out the wrong door, because this is where it leads to the lighthouse. And, well, I'm sure I can maybe do a side quest later. I think it's best if I do it as soon as I possibly can. I am going to probably do something really, really stupid, because... The general store was at the motel, which of course it sounds obvious now because it was like the thing that stuck out from everything. Uh, this might be a waste of time because right now the world is in other world mode. But I'm going to see if it's possible for me to get to that motel right now. If not, then I'm sorry for you guys watching me fail or trying to do something. I'll probably just reload my checkpoints and be have to run by monsters to get there. This dog that's fucking in the way of the ladder. Thanks, doggy. But if this is a, a successful, then I'll be just fine. I'm just hoping that I can actually still do this side quest, because if not, this was indeed my theory was correct. This is for the good ending of the game. And to be honest, I predicted this because I knew there was a cutscene that we dubbed when we were doing the dubbing session of Silent Hill 1, and I knew that it came before the cutscene I just saw when we were dubbing it, so I was pretty sure that this was the side quest, because I know that I, I didn't know what item it was, but I knew there was an item that you're supposed to obtain in Silent Hill 1 and able to obtain the good ending. I'm just hoping me saving over the last point didn't just obsolete any chance I had at getting the good ending. Because that would majorly suck so bad. Like, really just suck. Oh, God. I might have skipped my chance to get the good ending in this game. Because what was supposed to happen, I was supposed to go to the motel, that's right over here, and I was supposed to meet Kaufman there. There might be a chance I can get there later in the game, though, because I know, I, I think that they might ma let me go back. Hopefully, they'll let me go back. If they don't let me go back, I am boned on getting any of the good endings. But all the same... And no offense, I like the bot, the final boss and the good ending a lot more than I like the final boss and the bad ending. I, I won't spoil who they are right now, but they're different bosses depending on what ending you go. Because there's a total of, like, I think, well, a total of five endings, can, including the UFO ending. But the UFO ending, you can't get till you beat the game once, so... In fact, to be honest, if I was going for the UFO ending, I'd be almost done with the game right now. So I must be nearing the very end of the game, because... I know for a fact that the lighthouse is the final place in the UFO ending, so if I was going for the UFO ending, I'd have to have looked in a few special places right before now, and then this lighthouse would be where the game would end, because it's where the UFO ending takes place. So if I was going for the UFO ending, I'd be right at the end of the game right now, but since I'm not the UF going for the UFO ending, I've got a bit more to do. <laughs> There's like two monsters. At first, I got hit by one of them. But... I would rather be grabbed by a pterodactyl. Wait, wait, what? Really? I, I wasn't paying attention to my health, but I didn't think I was that low. Tips if you blah 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 blah. Well, that was stupid. So what's my health on right now? I have a few healing items, so... Yeah, my health was on lower than I realized. I'll use a health drink. Alright, so as I said, anyways, the lighthouse would be the end for the UFO ending. Yada yada. I know which way I'm running to at least, so... I'm starting to get daylight though, which is good. You kind of need like, these type of games at night, so... I know you 
love me and everything, but our love is forbidden. <laughs> Being mauled down by different monsters. It's not a fun feeling. Going the right way, right? Yep, I'm going right to the lighthouse. To the lighthouse. <laughs> like zigzagging everywhere right now. These terrible controls. Being mauled to death by different monsters. Use a health drink. This is the wrong one. I was hoping it would be a wrong one. Really nice to have. say this isn't really too late for me to miss the side quest. If I miss the side quest, I will be sad faced. Alright, so since I saved over the safe state that I could have used to go back to a certain extent, we'll just move forward and see how this turns out for us. That's a very interesting way to present a lighthouse area. One that can only be done these days, because other games people control about the controls being shoddy, but the controls in this game are already shoddy, so they got nothing to lose from doing this interesting spiral thing. This really makes me think of the movie You Mizaki, which came out later, but that movie was all about spirals, and there was a stair, like even, even like a spiral staircase sequence like this that was used to great effects, so. Of course, there was someone who jumped down the middle and committed suicide, but all the same. Infamous cutscene for the win! Wait! I've seen such movies as Oh my god, Damn, I'm going it was too late. late. Heard of that movie. It's not too late. So, I might be able to complete that side quest. Uh, this doesn't feel right. There's no reason for me to go back, so I'm just going to reset the game for one second because I just saved and I feel like there's something else for me to do there. Bring it. I know I got hit by a dog a little bit, but. So, I don't think I'm going to have another chance to. Hope I Hopefully, after the amusement park, I'll have a chance to actually go back. And do the quest because I am definitely still in other world mode. You know, at this point, I don't think I'm gonna be able to complete the quest. But if I ever get a window of opportunity to, I'll definitely try. Anyways, though, time for an instance of fun backtracking. Oh, fucking dogs! Everyone's favorite part of every old horror game ever: backtracking. I was gonna say I was surprised the turret didn't catch on to me, but I hear his feelings flapping, so. Guess I'm going to the amusement park right now. Yep, there's an arrow on my map pointing to something, so I better check out that point on my map.
Apparently I'm supposed to go through here, which is something like the sewers. The cover has been removed. Is it both gone to the eastern part from here? That might just be what might be guessed there, Mr. Murray. Another sewer level. This one is probably longer than the last one, which of course is fun-filled times.